constitutionally has just attempted. Should that happen? The flag bearer has gone for a running mate. Mr. Speaker, under normal circumstances, they should have given us a, a running mate who would give a future to Ghana. Like we have given a flag bearer who would represent the future of Ghana. You have brought a flag bearer, a flag bearer who, a running mate who retired from the UCC as VC, came to Ministry of Education, performed abysmally the e blocks. She could not complete them. She did only 29. Today you say the the running mate should 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 be the future of this country. But that we know the president of the republic is 18 years. Therefore, an attack on somebody who is 17 years is a speaker, is an attack of the president of the republic. And when he said the running mate is 17 years and therefore there's no sense of agency in him. We were expecting the speaker to call him. Because Anadu is over 18 years. Yes. And we didn't make mistakes. He's telling us that we did a mistake. He's voting for Anadu, who is 18 years, yes. for misleading the country. Yes. So, Mr. Speaker, we are going to call him to expand that aspect from well, well, well. the hands yes. well, well, That well, is why well. the bank was making noise. Honorable Did we make Amen. a mistake in voting 18 years for Anadu into power? You can pay for him. You support and promote an 18 year old man, and you see nothing wrong with it. But for our point, but for our point, my Kukwe would have been the speaker here. How old is he? He must be expelled from the hazard. That statement must be removed from the hazard. You cannot be promoting an 18-year-old man. Withdraw your president is always sleeping. You are talking about it. Withdraw and apologize. Is it because she's a woman? Is it because she's a woman? Is it because she's a woman? Withdraw and apologize. Is it because she's a woman? Is it because she's a woman? Is it because she's a woman? You promote and support an 18-year-old man, and you have a problem with a 17-year-old woman. Is it because she's a woman? Withdraw, withdraw, and apologize. Honourable, what? He spoke. Yes, Honourable Ato. No, speaker. Where am I? Honourable Ato. I'm here to speak. Yes. Honourable, Honourable Hit, I haven't called you. I'm here to speak. Honourable Hit, I haven't called you. No, we are being too much. No, I will say. Honorable members, right. I suspend the house for one hour. Sitting was suspended for an hour. When proceedings resumed, the majority leader apologized for his comments and calm was restored. Not to denigrate their running mate on the basis of age. So I withdraw that aspect of the submission. The leaders crossed swords on the presentation made by the president, Nana Danko Kufuado when he appeared before the House in February. ...of the Akufuado Baumia government has been, Mr. Speaker, to overborrow. This government will be remembered for destroying indigenous banks. This government will be remembered for domestic and international haircuts. This government will be remembered for destroying many Ghanaian families through dreadful economic policies, particularly high taxes. Mr. Speaker, this is the true state of our nation. The House deliberated upon a statement about the onset of the Ramadan fasting for Muslims. A special appeal was made to senior high schools to make provision for Muslim students during the holy month. Duke Mento Poku, TV3 News, Parliament House, Accra.